get the floor. But of course, my American style, I take my foot <laughs> and I wipe up like this because I feel like I'm freaking hazel. Like, I don't know how women here keep their back straight between cooking on the stove and sweeping and then going across the floor and mopping. Uh, it's like back breaking work. So, yeah, this is our place and our balcony is pretty pretty big. This is plan B apartment, so you know, plan A didn't work, so that's alright. Go to plan B and I'm happy with it and this is the big wall. I don't know if you can see it turn the video around. This is well let me turn it back because I don't know how it's gonna come out of this but, but yeah it's pretty pretty big so I was thinking I saw these Moroccan um, sectional type things. Trust me, I'm sorry people, but this is going to be non-typical American type house. <laughs> it's going to be quite gaudy and it's going to have um, these Moroccan style couches with Moroccan lights with Moroccan curtains, which I just ordered them to be made for because the the problem is with the balcony door is uh, it's a little bit uh, non-standard, so they have to. I had to get more fabric to have them make it, and it's going to go across the whole thing. And then, if you don't know about Senegal, they actually um, they put basically curtains on every open airway, basically. So there, which is good because. I've been noticing a lot of mosquitoes, and I guess maybe that's why they do it. I'm not quite sure. But this is the flooring. I love the flooring because when it's hot, the floor is actually so cold. And me and the kids, <laughs> you know, probably people think we're cuckoo for Bubba Pops, but you can actually lay on the, um, the floor because it's more cold on the floor than it is when you have sleepovers. So. But this is the entryway to the uh, living room, which if you close the door, every door in this place has a key. Every door has a key. So if you close it, it closes with this. So basically if you're having a conversation, then you basically can have it in private. So, and of course we're only having uh, <laughs> One TV, like always. No cable. Um, I think Alison did get something for her, something else. So. And that's pretty much it. The kids are asleep. They had a long day. So for Rocky, he's out. Alison's getting his hair cut. It's about, I think about eight something now. So Alison's getting Rocky's hair cut and. And uh, tomorrow I'll get the girls hair braided. Yes, I, I will be paying $5 to get their head braided. <laughs> Especially since the place I'm usually if, we're, if we were at the old um, place, we would pay $20. But since we're out in the country area, um, it's only $5. So here we go. Uh, uh, sorry for the picture. I'll try to take a um, better picture. All right, then. Everyone have a good night. Um, once Alison gets back with Rocky, um, headed to bed, yes, because there is a rooster that has to wake us up at the crack of dawn, so I know I need to get sleep. So, so everyone, peace and blessings. And, you know, this has been a dream of mine for a while, and I had to put it to fruition and, you know, take a leap of faith and just do it. Um, I haven't explained too much of what am I exactly going to be doing here. But in due time, I'll let everybody know and show you my projects uh, of how I'm going to sustain my living, of course, with the help of, um, of Alison, which, you know, he, he works with a, a regular, uh, what you call it, job. So, not meaning mine's irregular, but. <laughs> But I'm just saying, he, his job is more, you know, reliable than my work. So, um, I'd like to thank everybody for the well wishes and the flowers.
life is horrible. But uh, other than that, um, and I also got a tablet to do videos, but you know, it, it is what it is. It doesn't have the best grade. But, alrighty, peoples. Talk to you later. Bye.